Hi, how's everyone doing? It's the Barca boy and I've got some more news news today. And we start with the news that the under-21 squad have won again. Really great for them. This time, 1-0 to Ipswich. And it came in the last seconds of the game. 85th minute penalty scored by that man, Femi Akinwade, again. I mean, I think we should start trying to get him into the first team picture now. He's scoring mostly every game, if not one every two games. I think we should just put him as a sub first and maybe bring him on for the last 15 minutes of a match. Even if we are losing, I'd like to see him try because he's obviously got talent in the kid. And I think the way he's come through, I think it's sort of like a Jamie Vardy story. You know, got rejected by a couple of Premier League clubs and Championship clubs and now... Start from the non-league and now start to work his way back up. But I'd like to see him get started. But also great for the under 21s again. I mean they lost last week, but it's great to see they hasn't knocked their confidence at all and they're back on the winning streak. Now because it's half term, the Colu have been doing activities for the, um, the younger children plus older children for them to do football activities during half term. And it's great to see that the squad have been involved as well. Not just the first team, but the under 21 squad as well. With after they've done their activities, whether it's a tournament or like skill school or whatever, I don't know what they're called, but the squad have actually gone after and they've done um, signed stuff, did interviews, which is great, like Q&As. Also, Kevin Keane was there, so it's good to see that he obviously wants the youngsters to be, because I don't know how to put it, but he obviously wants us to keep that youngster tradition going I mean the foreword of it was written by George Elikobi talked about bringing even more youngsters through and be fair soon I reckon our first team maybe one day might just be just all of um, academy players and it's great to see that Kevin's got the backing of this and I'm glad to see that Cole you are, are doing this and if you look at their activities there's actually quite a lot of activities so it's not a lot of news today there wasn't much but also because I'm adding this on to the end because of what happened on Tuesday, no video because it didn't upload and I've also added this on at the end um, there will be no debate um, this week so look out for next week Thank you all for watching the video today if you did enjoy it please leave a like and subscribe for more videos like this and others and I'm sorry there was no debate. I think just because of the fixtures and the Saturday than the Thursday one, I had to sort of fit in another preview and a review. So that's sort of ruined my schedule. But should be all normal next week. Expect a preview of the match tomorrow against Berry. And bye. Everybody jumping out of their mind. Everybody going out of their skins. Everybody jumping out of their